talk about why we should all love forms. And uh, that's possibly your first thought about forms. But consider this. If you need any kind of donations, e-actions, newsletter sign-ups, volunteering, referrals, all these people that we work so hard to get together online, all of those people have to fill in a form at some point. It is the point of entry to your organization online. But the big problem with forms is that we have a big fat dropout rate because they're boring. So I have some thoughts for you about how we can solve this really, really important problem. What if you made a radical change to your web budget and instead of pouring all of your effort into the look and feel of the home page and the content page, what if you spent a third of your budget on this really important point of contact between you and your potential supporter? And then what if you spent another third of your budget on the thank you experience, the thing that gets them from the form into a deeper relationship with your organization and the rest of the budget on the initial experience? Wouldn't that make the forms much more fun and compelling and brilliant? This is one of my bugbears, and it makes me quite cross, actually. I get an email from a charity that already has my email address asking me to fill in a petition form where I have to give them my email address again. This is bad juju. And the amount of people you are losing because of this silly problem is, it, it just, it should not happen. So uh, make sure when you send someone an email, and you ask them to fill something out, that all of the details you already have about that person are pre-filled in the form, so they don't have to spend ages retyping the stuff you already had, have. So I think most of us know what a, how a split test works. Um, but split test your forms. N nowhere near enough people use this technique. And it's, it's so important. And you need to have systems that enable you to build forms quickly and easily, like Engaging Networks, Blue State Digital, Campanian, so that you can uh, create different versions of a form to make sure um, that you, you get the most value out of that form by seeing which one works the best. But now my favorite bit. Why not have fun with your forms? So something I'd love to see, but which I haven't yet, is a form that builds a picture as you fill it in to give you some reward to keep going uh, in this horrible thing. Or this is an interesting example of a donation form that uh, was built for Humane Society International on the Engaging Networks platform. And this slider at the top, the further you move that from the left to the right, uh, the more animals come out of the cage. And that's it. That's my suggestions for making that initial experience and that initial connection between your supporter and the organization much better. And so if you want some help or some outside, an outside look at the way your forms work, then please contact me by, by either of these methods. Thank you.